Okay, we're back in Illustrator and we're working on our Olympic rings. We've uh, organized the Olympic rings so they're nice and evenly spaced in the right way. Uh, we're now going to color them in. So follow the exact color coding. So top left is a blue one. The bottom right is a yellow one. Top right is a red one. And the bottom left, bottom right, sorry, is a green one. Okay, right now to get them working properly we've got to turn some of the links inside each other they've got to overlap in a certain way and the way I'm going to do it this time is I'm going to select the circles I'm going to expand the circles okay and now I've broken up the, these circles into lots of different bits so okay I'm going to um, duplicate that I've got my backup layer. I'm going to hide that and select these circles. Turn on the Pathfinder tool, and in the Pathfinder tool, I'm going to press on the Divide tool, and that has um, made each of uh, these parts. You know, can you see what it's done? It's um, broken up the parts when they overlap. Okay, I'm going to check right this shape needs to go underneath so well I could either I could delete it no I couldn't I could uh, color it in red so change its color to uh, oh, I'll do that again um, select it pipette tool select the color I want it to change to okay let's see if I accidentally moved it or oh, I moved it sorry do that again pipette tool red next one is you're pressing the A to jump to the white arrow. Uh, pipette tool black. Um, pipette tool uh, black. And uh, pipette tool um, blue. Right, and now you can see the um, the shapes are all uh, correctly overlapping. Oh yeah. If I put in a black outline, does it go belly up? Oh yeah, you don't want to do that. Okay, there you go.